After you create a lesson or folder, you can populate it by adding questions. You create questions by using the CPS Question Author window. Before creating a question, set the default font to apply a font style and size of your choosing to current and future questions. To do this, click the Settings menu and choose Default Font. Choose the font, style, and size that you want for your questions. Click OK. Now we'll open the Question Author window. Click on the Prepare tab and then Lessons and Assessments. Select the folder or lesson in which you want the question to appear. Click the New button in the Home group on the ribbon. Select Question from the menu. The Question Author window will open. Use the main ribbon in the Question Author window to complete the following tasks. In the Navigate group, you can create a new question, save a question, and remain in the current Question Author window, close the Question Author window, move to Previous or Next Questions without saving, or save the current question and move to Previous or Next Questions. In the Font group, you can utilize the following buttons to change the text options for a question. You can change the font, font size, add bold, italic, underline, strike through, superscript, subscript, add a character map, use select stems, and change the font color. In the format group, you can select a question type to choose if it's true or false, yes, no, multiple choice, numeric, or a performance question. Under template style, you can select from a chalkboard style question, a question with no graphics, or a question with graphics. In the options group, you can use the engage menu to show a question image after response, show an image full screen, exclude a question from self-pace or practice assessments, and engage a question as freeform. You can use the Question menu to add standards, categories, notes and media, and a difficulty level. Finally, there's the Proofing group to preview a question or check spelling. To add your question to the Question Author window, choose a question type in the Format group. Type the question in the question box. Then type in your answers. Select the correct answer by clicking in the checkbox beside that answer option. Click Save and move to the next question. Repeat these steps to add any additional questions to your lesson. When you're finished adding questions, click Save, then Close in the Navigate group. This concludes the training video for creating a question in CPS.